Johnson from our sister station Local 5 has been on the route the entire way. Good morning, sir. Great to see you once again. Tell us about the sights, sounds and smells of leading into <laughs> Centerville today. Hey, good morning to both of you. It's, it is the major sporting event. And the best part about RAGBRAI is everybody gets to participate. We saw folks in their 90s yesterday. We saw folks who had a, uh, disabilities out on the road as well, not letting anything keep people from this sea of humanity. You see behind me, I was able to pluck a couple guys. Luckily, we're on a hill today. We were able to pluck a couple guys off the route. Uh, riding today, we have, uh, we have Ted Schultz and we also have Scott Matter here. Now these guys don't know each other, now they do. We're from Grinnell and we're from Lytton originally. Now he's out in New York City. Let's start with how is the route going for you? You've done this before. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's number 14 for me. Um, it's gone great. You know, the first day we had some rain, but other than that, it's been wonderful. Yesterday with the loop was about 120 miles, which was a little long. But it you was, did the loop? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. And it was, it was, you know, about 10 miles to go with the whole thing after, you know, you're like, like I'm kind of ready to get off my bike. But it, <laughs> it was, it was a lot of fun and it was just beautiful area out there. All right. So Scott, what did you do? Did you do the, were you a stud yesterday? <laughs> I did not go. Yeah, see, you're with me. Don't worry about it. It's okay. How was it for you? Uh, we're getting a great week. Rag Ride is really a celebration of Iowa, and we're getting the best of everything this week. And especially early in the mornings, you hear the roosters crowing, <laughs> cows mooing at you. It's really, it's, we're having a great week. Yeah, it's fun to see the out of state folks that you know aren't from here because they stop and they take pictures of every barn <laughs> that you see. And then they're just amazed with all the green, you know, all the mm -hmm. corn and soybeans that we have that are, that are planted. Today's theme is uh, Rag Bride Jersey Day. You've got yours on, but it's also geared to be weird. Geared to be weird. What does that mean for each of you on Rag Bride, you think? So I, I have quite a few uh, different jerseys with my dogs on them. Some have the my, both my dogs. This is Oscar here. Archie's on the back. And um, they're my babies. And uh, I have a lot of people say, oh, is that your dog? Is that your dog? And, I, and they're always saying, oh, I miss my dog so much. And I never hear anybody say I miss my spouse so much. But they always say I miss my dog. So it's crazy. I don't know. But yeah, that's the way I can still have them with me on the ride. Hey, that's not weird. That's pretty sweet, I think. What, is, what does it mean to you to have this theme geared to be weird today? Well, I think ha the key to being happy life is to be you. Um, Cyclists are all about fr flying their freak flag, whatever that is, <laughs> yes. and Fairfield's kind of quirky, so we're going to celebrate all that tonight when, yeah. we get, when we get there. I was looking on the route, and I looked at all the towns, and I saw Fairfield, and I go, yeah, that could be, that could be different. You know, that could be a different place with uh, all the different mixes of people that we have here. I think the weirdest thing I've seen was the, did you guys see the guy in the Speedo with the American flag? Have you seen him yet? You see him? He was guiding. He was guiding traffic yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> he was guiding traffic. And the best part is, is that, uh, and we talked about this right before we came out live. Is it is a, a coming together as as a sea of humanity. You see, folks, just it's like you put all the the worries and woes of the world behind you. You get one week to just be you, raise your flag. And you don't worry about the stuff that divides us. Yes, absolutely. Uh, like you, we were talking off air. Uh, there's really nothing, you know, there's no Republican, Democrat, no none of this. Of course, there's the Husker and assorted others. <laughs> we'll we'll but... get into that tomorrow on College Jersey Day. <laughs> okay. Yes, but yeah, you're, you're right. A lot of a lot of the labels and, and uh, the things people think are, you know, yeah. not with us this week. That's right. I agree. Tomorrow's, tomorrow's the most fun day of RAGBRAI. Um, there's always way more cyclones than hawks or panthers <laughs> and a very small number of corn huskers out. So it's a great day. Just when we were starting to get along too, right? Hey, Scott, nice to meet you nice both. To meet you. Thanks. You guys take care. Good to see you again. Absolutely. See, the day that we came across, Mr. Schultz was on College Jersey Day. He had the huskers on. So, so yeah, we, uh, we'll we get into some ribbon tomorrow. Thanks again, you guys, for making the time. And uh, we sh we're going to have some fun today. Heading over to Fairfield. Bloomfield's the meetup town. We should have the coolest picture today is going to be going over the the Des Moines River in between a couple of towns. So we'll uh, have those visuals as well. It's been great catching up with you folks. We'll do it one more time tomorrow morning on day six. But today we're going to get through day five, riding Rag Ram Elias Johnson for CW Iowa Live. Back to you. Yeah, he looks surprisingly Looking good. good. Elias. Yeah, yeah. yeah, keep up the great work and love hearing all these fabulous stories. We we'll look for more later on today. <laughs> <laughs> what a stud on Rag Ride. So he's great. It, it's 10